Welcome to 2K Sports and another exciting edition of NBA Ball. We'll watch the Memphis Grizzlies in this one as they go up against the Milwaukee Bucks here at Pfizer Forum. Hi, everyone. Here with analysts Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. I'm Brian Anderson. Allie LaForce, our reporter. Allie, take it away. John Moran, a first-time All-Star in 2022. His teammates say he is the best point guard in the league. Morant said, quote, I'm a very humble guy, but also confident. So I'll let my teammates continue to talk for me. I'll just do what I can do on the floor to prove them right. Brian, Coach Jenkins said, quote, all he cares about is winning. Indeed. Thanks, Allie. We expect this one to be intense with two very athletic teams giving their all to capture the win, Clark. And they both like to play a very fast-paced, energetic game, running hard, trying to score easy buckets. And that will lend itself to the conditioning level perhaps being the difference in who comes out on top. And Holiday subbed in for Hill. Out of the Kumpo, the pass to Allen. Brooks against Middleton. Out of the Kumpo, a screen on Brooks. Milwaukee, no good that time either. And Grant, I guess for the Bucks, hey, you can't teach size. And they're good fundamentally as well, B.A. I mean, they block out, they fight to maintain position. If you're going to beat them, it probably won't be with second chance points. Now here's Adams. And here's Morant outside. Connects from downtown. Morant's got seven. Look at the mechanics on Morant's shot. He can totally trust himself to hit the quick jumper. The Bucks trail. There's 53 seconds left in the opening quarter. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Misses off the left iron. He expects to make every one of those, and we expect him to make them too. Morant with it. Seven points in the game. Bain, the pass to Jackson. Over on it, Akumpo. Jackson can't get it to go. Fadeaway was the right shot there because he got his attempt away from the defender, but the touch was poor. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Moran against Holiday. Pass to Ana Kumpo. Shoots over Jackson. And Ana Kumpo the bucket on the assist by Holiday. He's got 14. You know, when Giannis is being this aggressive on offense, he can be really hard to stop. Defense needs to make an adjustment. And that does it for the first quarter. Grizzlies out in front. They lead by six. And the second quarter is on its way when we return. And Holiday subbed in for Hill. Now here's Holiday. Looking for his first basket still in this one. With the drive. It's hauled in by Ja Moran. Coach loves the execution, just not the result. That's okay. That's part of the process. And Grant, last season, Drew Holiday winning the NBA Teammate of the Year Award for the second time. Yeah, and in 2021, B.A., he got the NBA Sportsmanship Award, too. So needless to say, Holiday tremendously respected by his peers and known for his dedication to others. Boy, a big man with great touch from deep, always a valuable commodity in today's game. Kumpo up top. Defended by Jackson. Oh, it's blocked by Jackson. Allen against Bain. Up top, Brooks. A minute four left in the second period. That one's good for two. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Boy, the defense looks shell-shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now. On their heels. Now here's Holiday. Pass to Middleton. Up and over Brooks. And a great move by Chris Middleton. Middleton's got five points. Nice handles by Middleton. Actually, really impressive handle. Put on a show with that dribbling exhibition. Morant, the pass to Jackson. And he lobs it up to the rim. And then Morant with the dunk. Woo! <laughs> I just love that alley-oop slam, PA. Defense disorganized. Defense pays. Well, I tell you what, guys, this is really getting close to being real ugly. So it's Milwaukee now. 
After the basket by Memphis. Pass to Allen. From outside the arc. And the shot is good on the assist by Holiday. Allen's got his first three points of the game. I tell you what, he clearly is one of the best players in the league who does not get the same kind of gas that other guys do. But there's no better all-around guard in the NBA than Drew Holiday. Moran against Holiday. Outside Moran. From the arc. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. Ja Moran, he's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for the Memphis Grizzlies. Eight points. There's a minute 54 left in the third quarter. Holiday against Moran. On to Kumpo. Oh, and Giannis hammers it in. Phenomenal playmaking instincts from Holiday. Getting the ball to a ready shooter on time and on target. Holiday against Moran. Shakes him. Oh, there's Moran with the slam. <laughs> there's a move for you. Wow, just showed great creativity on his way to the bucket. Hey, bump the move. How about the finish? That's right, fella. Bang that thing. Portis, the pass to Holiday. Lana de Kumpo, outside. Up and in on the layup. Lana de Kumpo has got 36 points. He's scoring the rock at will, but he needs more help from his teammates. Memphis has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. Moran against Holiday. Now here's Moran. The D's right on him. And it's Memphis with another. An active score. Moran's role on this team is to be aggressive on offense and look to capitalize often. On the wing, Holiday, hounded by Moran. Holiday passes to Anadokounmpo. Outside, Ingles. Down to five on the shot clock. Three-pointer, Holiday. And it's Bain with the rebound. Bain's got six rebounds in the game. Two seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. Here's Adams. And it's slammed in by Adams. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. Does it as well as anybody, fellas. Tremendous skill while in the air. And here is Hanada Kumpo. From 11 feet away, and he gets the bucket. Hanada Kumpo's got 10 points in the quarter. And the Greek freak, boy, I tell you, certainly gets the green light. I mean, from that position especially. He's really developed into a nice score from that spot on the floor. At the end of the third quarter, a huge lead. This one may have already been decided. It's the Grizzlies just dominating this one. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get set for quarter number four. Jackson against Hunter DeCumpo. On the wing, Ingles to take the lead. Grizzlies with the rebound. Jackson's got his sixth rebound on the night. Outside Bain. Pass to Adams. Now Moran. Here he goes. Lays it up and banks it in. Moran's got 39. Can you say prime time player Morant, he enjoys delivering for his team in these parts of the game. And Milwaukee shooting 53%. Good efficiency on offense so far. Anadokounmpo is doubled. Ingles from outside. And a great assist by Anadokounmpo. And that one goes in. Anadokounmpo's got his fourth assist in this one. 141 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Doubled by Middleton. Brooks from outside. It's not going to go for him. And here are the Bucks now. Middleton passes to Holiday. Portis the screen. Pass to Ana de Kumpo. Outside, Ingles. And the Bucks 
hit again from deep. Not a bunch of energy from the defense, which is why he was free to knock that down. Moran against Holiday. Adams with a screen on Holiday. And then Moran with the jam. Oh, save that for the dunk contest. That flush was so extra. Whether or not this game is close, he's the same guy. Focused on finishing firm at the rim. Well, I tell you what, guys, the kids, the young kids like to say, that's doing too much. That falls into that category. That was too much. And stolen by Holiday. Here's Hanada Kumpo. And he buries it. <laughs> Great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the biggest moment of the game? Yes. Holiday against Moran. Right side Bain. Pass to Moran. 32 seconds left in the final quarter. There's Jackson with the three. Hanada Kumpo grabs the board. Here's Milwaukee. They're on a 16 to 6 run. Milwaukee calls timeout. They lead by three. 26 seconds left in the fourth. And an intentional foul right there. Good on the first. And that gives him a four point push to show up the haters. So he gets them both. And it's a five point game. A productive trip to the line right there makes this a two possession game. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. That'll be a move to remember. Wow. Yeah, great creativity in the air. A circus dunk for you right there, guys. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the have to foul right there. You just don't want them to run out the clock. Yeah, they have to extend the game. I mean, yeah, the calm demeanor of Holiday, it really helps him stay cool under pressure. Fantastic ball movement for them tonight. If things are definitely working offensively, a balanced attack is just so much harder to defend. <laughs> He's been tremendous at corralling misses all night. He drops the first one, and that increases the lead. And having two brothers in the league, I think, probably has added motivation for him to excel. Eight seconds left in the fourth. Morant finds Adams. The three from Bain. He can't hit that time. So we see the Bucks get the win here. Boy, a hard-fought game. They did a great job of holding on to the lead at the end. You get the coffee, because that's the way to close. You're going to face them. We'll do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Clark Kellogg, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. We'll see you next time.